Hello everybody, welcome back to another unboxing product review style video, I guess you could call it, on the Scooch and Steve channel. We haven't been posting for a while because we just had a baby, uh, a very beautiful little boy, and uh, we just got this puppy in the mail here called Plantfolio, and it is a portable potting station. So it's intended for our semi-dead plant there. No, it's for healthy plants. <laughs> it's, it's for healthy plants. This guy needs a little love. He needs some plant folio love. That's right. He needs some plant folio love because he's currently halfway dead. <laughs> and we're going to do a little opening of this. It just came in the mail today and it looks beautiful. Yeah, at first glance, it's like really quality craftsmanship. Really very pretty. Craftsmanship. It's a good word. It's a good, a good choice of words there. So we're going to do just the quality craftsmanship. <laughs> we'll do the size and the weight. Uh, and I have a little LaCroix can here for a sense of scale <laughs> and our dead plant there on the uh, right hand side. Yeah, it's a good size. It's um, compact. So it slides really easily like um, in a between like a you had to just like kind of file it somewhere, like on a bookshelf or like wherever you might need to like put it up against a wall or like between you... books. <laughs> sure, <laughs> it's a little tall for a bookshelf, I yeah. suppose, but um, that's it's really I think that is. it's pretty nice and narrow. Oh, it's the exact size of <laughs> your hand and your forearm. <laughs> so know. I'd say probably well. 15, 16 inches okay. by 16 inches or so, yeah, something nice, like that. Perfect square. So the intention here is that it flips open. There's hinges on the side There's here. There's hinges and then we have a latch. So you unlatch this and if you're living in like a big city or something like that, this yeah. would go over your your sink. Yeah. And you would be using this to make a non-mess a reality. Yeah, it's for indoor gardening, right? Like house plants. Yep. Oh, this is really pretty. Ooh, look at that. So it's like a piece of, what would you call this, it's silicone? A, it's a rubber tray. Do you want me to take it out of the room? Yeah, Sorry. take it out. So a rubber tray. And it's got a nice little lip around the tray. Nice little lip to protect. <laughs> That's right. Because it has a little indention down here, so the lip covers around the edge. And then you just have this little washable sleeve where all of the dead plants, our dead plants uh, materials go in and then you just throw it in the trash okay. and wash this. So it's like recessed here and then this little rubber thing lives here, right? Like that's when it, when you collapse it again. <laughs> that's where it lives. That's where it lives. That's where it lives. That's right. It's vernacular in our household. That's right. I mean, Good your, word. Where do your socks live? <laughs> Good <word>. Vernacular. <laughs> so if we can get a close up on this. This actually has the plant folio logo on it right there, which is super slick. Very slick. Very slick. You're using words like vernacular and I say slick. Mm -hmm. Okay, so same, same piece, another rubber mat. So two rubber mats with two recessed spots. Yeah. And then these are cool. They're like, is that, is this like, what's that thing called? Tyvek or? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's uh, waterproof, right? Yeah, very, very and thick. And heavy duty, right? Like you can't. You could even put like a pair of glasses down mm -hmm. there. Look at that. Your shovel and your your spade, not shovel. Yeah. Shovel, garden spade, and. Put your scissors over there. Yeah. On your, that side. For trimming your roses and trimming the dead off of here. Let's. That's right. There we go. The dead. You probably mm -hmm. just have to chop it in half. <laughs> Got dead. Dead leaves there. Dead leaves here. Mm -hmm. So what do you do? Just, yeah. You just chop all the way. I don't know. I'm not going to pretend that. <laughs> I'm not going to pretend that. I'm not going to pretend like I don't have a garden. There you go. You can just chop it. There yes. we go. Yeah, great for beginning gardeners. Yeah, we are definitely beginning gardeners. And many people are yeah. now. Yeah. Many people are. Because this is the type of thing where... This we, would be really great. Sorry, I just totally cut you off. You go right ahead. Um, for like a, an herb garden. Like if you wanted to start growing your own herbs inside. Because right. so it, it's the worst when you try to go to the grocery store and get um, like a bunch of thyme or um, some mint. 
and you don't need as much as the bundle is and whatever and whatnot. If yeah. you just want to make one mojito and you only need enough mint for one, um, and you have your own herb garden and you can maintain your herb garden with this. So this is, these are really cool, this is great. Yeah, and what I just realized is you could have one open and then, or one closed and one open. So uh -huh. if this was over my sink right now, uh -huh. you could be dumping or cutting off the dead leaves of our halfway dead plant here and then pouring, you know, maybe water. some water. So water here. wouldn't, so you'd want to use the, this part over the sink for when you're watering so the water doesn't puddle over your rubber mat. But yeah. if you're trimming or pruning, I suppose, if it was a Good word. bonsai. Uh, <laughs> Good word, pruning. That's right. Good um, word. Then you would use the rubber. So and tools in here on either side uh -huh. and it collapses down. So in theory, you could just take this wherever you needed to go. You could take it on the go. And the hinge is just a 180 hinge, right? Like it doesn't. Yeah, no, yeah. It's just like a portfolio, like an art portfolio kind of opens up and an artwork is the plant. <laughs> it is the plant. That's the artwork. So that's that's pretty much it, guys. This is a pretty cool product. It's I super like it. Cool. I would recommend it to a beginning gardener. Craftsmanship. Great craftsmanship. High quality. Yep. Low, uh, compact, easy, um, very mobile. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what do you think mobile. about weight wise? I mean, it's heavy duty, right? So it's like high quality. It's not like this is real solid wood. What do you think? A pound? Less than a pound? No. Maybe two pounds? <laughs> don't even try. <laughs> don't try with the pounds. So, I, five out of five stars. I really like it. If you guys do want to check this out, the link will be in the description below. Mm -hmm. And we'll try and do more videos uh, in the coming months. Maybe on baby products? Yeah, maybe on baby products. Uh, we got an exciting announcement coming very soon for the blog. So stick around for that. And that's it for this review. Go check it out and like this video.